hello wonderful people so welcome back to my channel this is the only onwara a content creator based in just city nigeria here in this in this channel i talk about business how to start your own bk okay, guys so now in today's video i want to take you through how to install alipay app how to activate it you know this is a very very important app if you want to if you want to import directly from china if you want to import directly that is doing it yourself this is a very very is a must have app like you have to install this app activate it do some necessary setting okay so to my reasoning called subscribers you guys are the real deals. if you just came across this video for the first time thank you for clicking on it here in this channel, I talk about business, how to start your own business, how to brand your business, anything that has to do with you being your own. From my experience, guys, <laughs> I also share some DIY. So ensure to subscribe to this channel because you have lots and lots of things to learn and gain here. So guys, let's go into the videos of today. So the, ne the first thing I need you to do is to go to your Play Store. Your Google Play Store. And then type Alipay. Go to the search bar. Type Alipay. This is the app here. I already have it installed on my phone. So I'll just go ahead and open it. If you don't have it, you install it first. Then open. Okay, I've crossed some parts. Immediately you open it for the first time. You'll see a kind of writing. A Chinese writing. And at the bottom, you see a white bar and a blue bar. Okay? That first writing you see there is their terms and condition. If you've watched my previous um, video on how to translate 168 app, how I used High Dictionary Translator, you can also use that High Dictionary Translator to translate um, that first pop out you see. That's just their terms and condition. What I want you to do, just click on the blue bar. The one at the... Um, the one at the right hand side of your screen, that will be the first thing to pop out before this one you're seeing right here on my screen. So once you click on that, that's agree. You click on it, then the next thing is this particular place you're seeing. So from here now, you um, I've already changed this country code. You can change yours as well. If yours is in plus eight C's, click on the drop down button here. Click on that button and locate Nigeria if you're in Nigeria. If you're outside Nigeria, you locate your own country code. Then you click on it. Then you add up your number. Please and please add your number with the first zero. Okay? Add your number. Then you click on next. So now a code will be sent to this number. So make sure the number you're adding is handy. It's close to you or it's your own number. So a code will be sent. Let's wait and see. Good. Here comes the code. Four. What did I do? Four, seven, seven, nine. So four, seven, seven, nine. So now service agreement. Click on agree. And just let it load. So from here now, so it's still loading. Something is still loading there. Let's just give it some time. Would you like to use the international version of Alipay? Click yes, because you are not in China. You are not a Chinese. So click yes. We are using the international version. Do you get? So click yes. So here we are. Here we are. The first thing I want you to do, this is the home page. The first thing I want you to do is to click on me. So guys, the next thing to do is to click on me at the bottom of your screen. I've cycled it already. Click on it. You see where it's written me. You click on it. Then you see here, you see your name, your nickname is on set. Click on this sidebar, side button or side arrow, whichever one you call it. So just click on it. Sorry. 
click on the side arrow. Then you see profile home page. Like you need to go and add a profile picture. Your just add a profile picture first. So let me just choose anything at all as a profile picture because this is just a sample Alipay. I already have my Alipay account. So now I'll click on choose from photos. So I've picked a photo. I'll click on use. So let's wait for it to load. Wait for it to load. So just follow this step accordingly and guys if you've not subscribed to this channel you are missing out you are missing out you are missing out so ensure you smash that subscribe button and don't forget to turn on the notification to get notified whenever i upload so here we are my picture is good here okay so let's go back from here we already have a picture then the next one is to click on set nickname this particular one this one set your nickname so i'll click on it then name um what can i use now let me use this my name and click on save good so guys from here as you can see i've filled up the important things we need for now so our alipay is set the next thing is to verify it you need to verify your alipay account with an international passport okay just as i said earlier this is a sample alipay um i'm just trying to show you how to uh, um, install it and then activate it i already have a, a working alipay account i'm using you get so this is just a sample one i'm creating so the next thing you need to do is to click on bank card this one here click on it click on bank cards it will take you to another page so let's just wait for it a bit so from here just click to add click here to add click here oh no sorry Come on, this is the hell. Here we are. So from here, click to enter your bank card. Enter your bank card number. That is, preferably, guys, ensure you're using uh, a MasterCard. Okay. So I'll just add a random number, which I think might not go through, but let me just try on. Let me try and see. So just add your bank card here. That's the first thing you need to do and click submit. It's not a correct bank card. That's why it's giving me this. The bank, the MasterCard I used, I have, the only MasterCard I have, I've already used it in to verify my working Alipay account. Okay. So this is just the necessary step. Just follow the, after here, follow the necessary step you see on how to um you have to enter your bank card number that's your atm card number your cvv your cvv is a three digit number behind that your secret number behind your 
ATM card so you include that as well after everything you click OK it will take you to a place where you need to verify your face um, your face then you load your international passport details and the rest of them so that's just the process you need to do